Shih Tzus are little dogs with big personalities. But just like any other breeds, they have their own quirks and challenges. So in today's video, we will talk about the good, the bad, and the ugly of Shih Tzu's personality. The good. Shih Tzus are known to be playful, affectionate, and outgoing. They are super social and enjoy being around people. Their adapting nature makes them an ideal choice for any living situation, from small apartments to large homes. They are also very good with kids, making them perfect family dogs. Overall, they have a very bright personality. And the cherry on the cake is that they aren't as noisy as other small dogs. Small dog breeds are naturally more vulnerable to danger and may feel the need to protect themselves more. That's one explanation why most small dog breeds bark so much. And if you don't know this already, their barks have a higher pitch, making them more irritating. But fortunately, that's not the case with Shih Tzus. Our little Shih Tzus are one of the least vocal small dogs. Yes, they can be noisy occasionally, but I think that's fine. The bad. One downside of owning a Shih Tzu is their stubborn personality. They were bred to be companion dogs, and they are excellent at it. However, due to the lack of history of working dogs, they may not be the brightest at following commands. So training them can be challenging, especially house training them. You will have to deal with lots of accidents before they learn to do their business outside. Apart from that, some Shih Tzus can also get possessive of their toys and food, and may even growl if someone tries to take them away. But of course, these challenges can be easily overcome with enough training. The Ugly just like any other breed, Shih Tzus are prone to some health problems, such as hip dysplasia, skin allergies, and eye problems. So you need to set up an emergency fund, just in case. Their gorgeous long coat requires a lot of grooming and maintenance, which can be time-consuming and costly. But to give you an idea, I brush my Bella's coat every day, bathe her once every month, and take her to a groomer once every three months. Neglecting their bad behaviors in their puppyhood can turn into full-blown habits as they grow. Again, this goes for any breed. But with enough training and care, everything's gonna be just fine. Before you leave, check out our channel. We have tons of Shih Tzu care videos. See ya!